Hi, my name is Patrick. This is about extempo. Some of the processes have extempo in the selection process, some colleges like FMS, etc. So, how do you? This is basically tips on how to speak confidently in an extempo. Okay, not a series on extempo, but just how to speak confidently in an extempo. So, let's start with it. We do run courses on management entrance and placements for interviews. Tip one it is very common to be anxious. I mean, Whenever you are in a very important process, you are always anxious, that's fine. So if you feel anxious about extempo, that's perfectly all right. The best speakers have always been anxious while going on the stage. Okay, but let it be not be evident to the panelists. I mean, one way to keep yourself calm is to breathe deeply. So when you go for the extempo round, ensure that you take deep breaths. It helps you to relax or calm your nerves. And that will help you to show the panelists that at least you are relaxed in the, in the extempo. Second, don't speak quickly. I mean, speaking quickly is a sign of nervousness. I mean, when you're nervous, you tend to speak a little fast. Okay. And because you tend to speak fast, you will run out, you'll run out of points quite quickly. Because when you speak points quickly, you will realize the points are out. I mean, you don't have points to speak. So it's important to pace yourself well. I mean, on a regular intervals, pace yourself. Speak slowly and it helps to communicate your message clearly. Okay. So the trick is speak on a calm basis, low basis, have a structured thought process. Don't speak too fast because speaking fast is a sign of nervousness. Speaking slow shows that you're more relaxed and you're able to communicate well. Tip three, normally people get confused in how to start and how to end. Advice able to have a standard template for start and to the end. For, end. for start, for example, you could start with introducing the topic itself and telling the meaning of the keywords. Or you could start with maybe giving a historical perspective of a topic. Or you could start maybe by giving something of current news with regards to a particular topic. Or could start with saying how the topic is important. Okay. This could help you reduce stress because once your template is ready, you could, you know, have a, st a standard start and you can go about starting your design. Same with the end, have a standard end. Maybe you'd end with a solution. Maybe you'd end with a summary of whatever you have spoken. So have a standard structure with regards to what you're going to speak. Okay, and this will also help you to structure your thought process well in the interview. Four, you need to show that you're confident. I mean, that one way to show is by having a proper eye contact. So when you're speaking with the panelists, ensure that you have proper eye contact with them when you speak with them. That shows, that's a sign of confidence. Lack of eye contact shows lack of confidence. Begin with a smile. I mean, smile is an amazing way to create a good first impression. So start with a smile. Show that shows that you're confident and also ensure that when you end, you end with a positive note. This will help you to create a great extempo. Okay. So follow these five tips, I'm sure it will help you. Right? We'll help, we'll come up with more videos that will help you with your PI VAT GD rounds. Right? Thank you.